don't fly IFR, real IFR for a while, and then you do it, and as soon as you enter the clouds, suddenly the heart rate goes boom, 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 boom. <laughs> and you're like, oh my god. <laughs> Trimmer, set for takeoff, throttle friction nuts tight, mixture is rich, magnetos are on both, master switch is on, pitot heater is off, primer in and locked, fuel is on the left tank with plenty, fuel pump on, flaps will take two, instruments two, two, zero. I'm heading out towards Lid to practice some real instrument flying. I'm going to do the RNAV approach to runway 21. I haven't done much flying in IMC recently, so I need to blow off some cobwebs. Golf Oscar Romeo holding Alpha 2, ready for departure clearance. Golf Oscar Romeo, tower, roger, hold position after departure, route via Godstone, climb, maintain attitude 1,400 feet. Hold position, outbound via Godstone, climb and maintain 1,400 feet, Golf Oscar Romeo. Golf Oscar Romeo, tower, line up 26 right. Line up 26 right, Golf Oscar Romeo. Golf Oscar Romeo, tower, 26 right, clear for takeoff, surface wind is 240 at 10 knots. 26 right, clear for takeoff, Golf Oscar Romeo. Here we go then, time is 56. Temperatures and pressures are green. Okay, must be Speed's alive. <laughs> We're away. Golf Charlie, November Tower. See, I'm fine. Are you getting any uh, interference on your transfer uh, receiver at the moment? Uh, negative. Okay, thank you. And uh, Golf Charlie, November Tower. See, I'm fine. On runway 26 right. You are clear to touch and go. 2408 knots. Clear to go, Charlie. Golf Oscar well clear to the east now. Uh, request frequency change, Farnborough East, 123.225. Oscar Romeo, Roger, Squawk 7000, free call Farnborough East, bye-bye. Squawk 7000, Farnborough East, Golf Oscar Romeo. Farnborough Radar, Golf Bravo, Hotel Oscar Romeo, traffic service. Golf Bravo, Hotel Oscar Romeo, Farnborough Radar, party message. Good morning, Golf Bravo, Hotel Oscar, Romeo, PA28, Red Hill to Red Hill, uh, IFR. Uh, currently two nautical miles northeast of Waypoint Tumby, altitude 2,200 feet, 1023, and uh, request uh, traffic service uh, IFR for a climb uh, above the cloud. Golf Oscar, Romeo, Squawk 1730, London QNH, correct, basic service. Squawk 1730, uh, basic service uh, 1023, Golf Oscar Romeo. Golf Oscar Romeo, please mention traffic, just uh, turn around, so it's now in your 11 o'clock, one mile opposite direction, indicating 200 feet below. Mitchell Golf Oscar, November. Alpha Radar, November 661, QRD. Reduce traffic information, do you control the workload, possible late warning of traffic, and confirm your routing. Uh, you were blocked there, was that for Golf Bravo Hotel Oscar Romeo? Romeo A firm, you identified traffic service, reduce traffic information, do you control the workload, possible late warning of traffic, and just confirm your routing. Reduce traffic information, and we're routing via LID, Golf Oscar Romeo. Roger, that's copy. Golf Oscar Romeo, request climb altitude 3,200 feet. Golf Oscar Romeo, climb approved. I'm approved, Golf Oscar Romeo. Lids Atis, tune my radios and prepare for my approach. Even though I planned to enter cloud, the act of doing so results in a burst of intense concentration. When you suddenly come into the cloud like that, well, I know that it wasn't sudden because I was expecting it. Golf Oscar Romeo, request a frequency change, uh, lid approach 120.7. Golf Oscar Romeo, service terminate, school 7000, frequency change approved. Goodbye. Service terminates, uh, frequency change approved, Golf Oscar Romeo. I'm level at 3,200 feet, proceeding towards Rompty. That's where the hold is for LID, and 3,200 feet is the altitude that the procedure starts from. You'll notice that I miss a few readbacks in my initial call to LID, 
That's simply because my brain is working overdrive, scanning the instruments and keeping the aeroplane flying safely. Lid approach at Golf Bravo Hotel Oscar Romeo. Golf Bravo Hotel Oscar Romeo, lid approach. Good uh, morning, passing message. Golf Bravo Hotel Oscar Romeo uh, is on a local flight from Red Hill IFR. Tenterton at 3,200 feet, 1024 with X ray. A request uh, on our practice, uh, runway 21. Golf Oscar Romeo, Roger, QNH 1024, procedural service, Cork 7067. And uh, would you like to route right to Rompty initially, or would you like to go straight for Saudi? A request a routing to Rompty for one uh, circuit for the hold, Golf Oscar Romeo. Golf Oscar Romeo, Roger, QNH 1024, procedural service, Squawk 7067, and clear to Rompty at altitude 3200 feet. Squawk 7067, procedural service, QNH 1024, procedural Rompty, 3200 feet. Golf Oscar Romeo. Six miles to Romty, and then Romty is inbound. One seven two. Because of the direction I'm heading, the entry into the hold at Romty will be what's known as a parallel entry. This means I fly over Romty, backtrack opposite to the inbound course, then make a left-hand teardrop back into Romty and then I can join the hold. This is much harder than it looks and corrections have to be made for drift. So we'll go out 325. Actually, no, yeah, 325. Laying off nine degrees of drift. Oh, God, I hate, I hate this. <laughs> got my to report final. Why do I do this to myself? We'll go, got Mike India. Just uh, making a parallel entry to the hold at Romty, Golf Horse Gromit. Roger, Golf Horse Gromit, thank you. Report when ready for the approach. We'll go Golf Horse Gromit. So it's 176543 127. Tally 10, touch again. Tally 10, report final number two, following the twin star on about half a mile final. Number two, copy the traffic, Tally 10. So now we go around left. At first, my turn was a little steep, so I've eased off now to compensate. One, seven, two. The centred CDI, or course deviation indicator, shows that I'm now tracking into Romti at 172 degrees, as specified in the procedure. Golf Mike India, now basic service, Squawk 7066. The actual dimensions of the hull pattern will not match that on the chart. That isn't important. The pattern you make will depend on your speed. What does matter is that you hold for one minute, or as specified by the procedure, and you track inbound on the correct course. So we'll do our pre-landing checks here now. So fuel is on, radio's tuned, engine temperatures and pressures, we've got tower, 119375. 20 seconds on this. Direction indicator 325. Altimeter 1024. And uh, brakes, undercarriage, mixture. 
fuel instruments. There's one minute. Top like India is passing right, changing to Farnborough 123225. You'll notice here that my outbound track has not made a perfect oval shape. That's completely intentional. The wind is coming from the west. As I make this right hand turn back onto the inbound course, the wind will push me back on course. And by the time I roll out from the turn, in theory, I should be right on the 172 inbound track again. Golf Oscar Romeo uh, Rob T ready for the procedure. Golf Oscar Romeo Roger Cliff the Arnav approach runway two one and report Rob T outbound. Cliff the Arnav approach uh, runway two one Golf Oscar Romeo and we'll go. So we're just over Ashford now. Brief glimpse through the clouds. Valley one zero downwind. Right to one oh nine. Roger, report final, runway 21. Report final 21, Roger, report final 21, Roger, report final 21, Roger, report final 21, Roger, report final 21, report on the final approach track. Report on the final approach track, Golf Oscar Romeo. Bit of turbulence here. Which is quite uncomfortable. One nine nine. Bennett one zero, final touch and go. Bennett one zero, runway two one, clear touch and go, surface wind two three zero degrees, one four knots. Clear touch and go. And now we can come down to 2700. Golf Oscar Romeo on the final approach track descending to altitude 2700 feet. Golf Oscar Romeo, Roger, report three miles to run to the missed approach point. Report three miles to run to the missed approach point, Golf Oscar Romeo. Even though the CDI is giving me vertical guidance, a bit like an ILS, this is an LNAV approach, not an LPV approach. So I must check my altitude at different points to make sure my descent profile is correct. The chart tells me what altitude I should be at at one mile intervals. Go 
at three miles, we want to be 1570. Oscar, after the go around, it will be a basic service, Squawk 7066. Basic service, Squawk 7066, go for Scrum. Three miles, 1570. Make one right hand orbit in current position. Report again downwind. Make one right hand orbit, turn it one zero. And uh, two miles, one one nine oh. Visual, so we can go around now. Golf Oscar Romeo, make a right turn out. Roger, Golf Oscar Romeo, thank you. Uh, one zero, report final from a uh, two one. You're following a uh, pair 28, currently one mile. That aircraft will shortly be going around with a right turn out. Report final, uh, Wilco PA 28, uh, only one zero. Tenterton, and what altitude will you climb to? We'll report passing uh, Tenterton, uh, climbing to altitude 1,800 feet. Cancel IFR, Golf Oscar Romeo. Roger, Golf Oscar Romeo, thanks. Now basic service, Sandscork 7066. Basic service 7066, Golf Oscar Romeo. Well, that was a big uh, bit of a workout, wasn't it? It's so strange. You don't fly IFR, real IFR, for a while, and then you do it, and as soon as you enter the clouds, suddenly the heart rate goes boom, 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 boom. <laughs> and you're like, oh my god, <laughs> and you're focusing on those instruments, and um, oh wow, that's that's hard work if you haven't, you know, done it for a little while. I hope you enjoyed the flight. Before we land back at Red Hill, a word about my premium subscription options. By joining my exclusive community from as little as £1 a month, you can watch my next video early without adverts. There are exclusive monthly updates and bonus videos with unedited versions of some of my flights. Go to my website to learn more. Golf Oscar Romeo, runway 26 right, wind 25 degrees, 6 knots, clear to land. Clear to land, 26 right, Golf Oscar Romeo. Thank you for watching. I'll be back with the next episode soon. Fly safely, my friends. Bye.